what makes football so special it's just a game they say but take out all the stars the money the glamour and i bet you'd still feel an undying love for the sport the reason is simple football is passion and the world cup is the people's tournament because it is the people the fans their artwork their love their madness that makes football become the beautiful game come then in our final episode at abj pidambura let us speak with the fans the people the artists but enough of me talking now let the ball guide us wall paintings posters scrapbooks artworks that's what football is all about as you can see the passion goes way beyond the ground and athletes come we are so lucky to have such talented artists at abj pitampura let's speak to them and get to know what's the thought process behind their artworks and by the way they prepared all this in a matter of a few days hi tell me your name and class and which painting have you made this is the painting i've made i'm srishti from class 8c okay. so this painting as the slogan says football is the most important of the less important things in the world Okay. So basically what i mean to say football may not seem that important but it may be a hobby to many and maybe a passion for many Excellent. so it adds joy to our lives so here this portion i have made it colored because here i want to say that we hold a passion we hold a in our heart in our heart for okay. football so clearly srishti has understood what football is all about it's the inner joy well done Okay so we move on to the next talented artist what's your name my name is Rishti Malhotra i'm from class 8a i've made this one uh, okay. so as the slogan says there's no pressure when you're making a dream come true so what i'm trying to say is when you're making your dream come true when you're going with your passion there's no pressure on your shoulder instead there's just pleasure and you want to make it come true and there's nothing wrong with that so both the sisters have one thing in common football is all about joy and passion well done girls what about you my friend I'm Kenisha and I made this poster I'm expect amazing this is this year's Qatar FIFA's main motto and this Lovely. is La Eve the main mo- the mascot. mascot of Qatar team the shoe and the ball with without football the life is like simple but with football it's colorful and lively my god did you see such a creative concept that without football life is colorless abj bidambura has some creative geniuses in their sleeves well done what about you hello i am sanskriti from class 11th so i have just collected this data regarding football but i just want to talk about how i think about art and football in general so i think all these paintings here just reflect the energy of the place and the game of football it- itself and how colorful it is and how joyful it makes people thank you so stats trivia and data football is incomplete without that thank you for adding such a wonderful thing let's go to the other artist what about you good afternoon i am noor arora from 8a okay. and i have made this which means what's life without goals so basically life is like a football game and in football it's very important to make goals so what's life without goals Okay that's a very valid observation football teaches us so much about life thinking on our feet getting ourselves back up when we fall to win together as a team well done champ okay so now we have the notorious boys let's see what they have to say yes i am raghav sharma from class 8th i have made the portrait of neymar junior he he is my favorite player from the brazil national team of football and while making his portrait i only remembered the matches he played and how uh, i think passionately he played his matches okay so we have a neymar fan so do you love his hairstyle his flicks his freestyle yes okay so this one is a style expert huh give me a high five so now we have the brilliant brilliant artwork look at the shades look at the texture look at the overall concept this is sheer genius let's speak with the amazing artist my friend What's your name? Tell Good me about afternoon. this. My name is Adnan. Uh, I'm from 9th class, 9A. I've made this banner, which is uh, just telling that uh, football is not just a passion. If uh, a person plays football, he he will play that like a passion. But uh, when we teach someone to play football, he, he will carry this passion for his lifetime. So you agree that football is passion forever? Yes, I agree. Well done, man. My friend, come here. What's yeah. your name? I am Malik Virmani from class 8D. As you can see, 
he is a Ronaldo fan and he's holding the scrapbook. So my friend tell me how much time did it take you to make this? Uh I started it in September and I will make it till my newspapers just like fill up in my room. Wow. That is such a passion. Show me, show the album. Wow. You can see such hard work, such passion. And this one is my favorite because this was the 700 goal by Ronaldo. So Ronaldo, in case you're watching this interview again, this one clearly loves you. You have one loyal supporter in India. What about you? I'm Aryan Gawande, I'm studying HC. I'm supporting Portugal. So <laughs> Okay. Well, your name? Garg. My friend, how do you watch the 12:30 game? Well, it's difficult bit, uh, like for between the schools, but it's FIFA what can we say? What can we say? So which match was the most exciting one so far? For me it was personally Japan versus Croatia. And why? Because I support Japan and I find the Japanese players are Asian so of course Asia it's a big chance for Japanese people to play in the round of 16. Well done my friend your name? Yashvira Joshi of 7C. I am Tanush Gupta and I support Argentina Messi. Okay you are running a 103 degree fever i'm told and you are still watching the game studying as well how are you managing it actually football bring, brings an enthusiasm and enthusiasm helps us to work my god salute to such a passion uh, hello sir i am tanishka thuri i i want argentina and portugal to be uh, in final and uh, give a good set back to ronaldo and messi so i am kon sadana from 8th my uh, i support portugal mostly but i don't think they will win this time because messi is playing too good and but the match which happened between portugal and switzerland was amazing ramos hit a hat trick we are here with the experts at abj pitambura you have seen the kids and they are the mentors because of them they are so excited and enthusiastic about the game sirs and ma'am we all welcome you so What is the secret behind such enthusiasm at APJ Pitambura? Uh we here uh, in our PE classes we we just uh, tell everyone to play whether uh, the girl or a boy the, they play all the games here. So that is the important thing here and we just motivate them to participate actively whenever they have their PE class in the ground. That all the kids I heard that they are watching the late night games and then they are again playing in the in the school they are giving their exams. So how are they managing it? Yes sir we are, our primary children are very excited about the FIFA World Cup and they knew even they uh, grab all the news about the FIFA World Cup in there and give all the information to the teachers also and we are also the learners from the students from our students hamare bachche bahut acche khelte hain ji aur football ke alawa pure games acche hain APJ school Pitampura actually uh, it's a blessing और एपीजे स्कूल के जो बच्चों के ब्लड के अंदर फुटबॉल है और जैसे हिंदुस्तान में क्रिकेट है ना ब्लड में एपीजे पीतमपुरा के बच्चों के अंदर फुटबॉल है दिल से फुटबॉल है सर वेरी ट्रूली सेड बाय माय टीम आई यंग किड्स आर वेरी मच ऑलवेज वेरी मच एक्साइटेड अबाउट द गेम नॉट ओनली फॉर फुटबॉल बट यस दे आर मैड अबाउट फुटबॉल सो वी आर विद द स्टार ऑफ एपीजे पीतमपुरा कौस्तुभ पांडे ही इज अ प्रोफेशनल स्पोर्ट्स जर्नलिस्ट He is working with so many big names, Al Jazeera, Italian Football News, you just name it. And at such a young age, Kostub, thank you for taking out the time. You must be very happy to be back here. Yeah, it's like the school provided me with a good platform to uh, reach this level. So yeah, I'm pretty happy to be back here. Okay, so that, does this ground bring some nostalgic memories back? Yeah, provides me a memory of me scoring an own goal. <laughs> uh me in like i think class 9 or something but yeah otherwise the ground ground sort of serves serves me with good memories well costu may have scored a non goal in class 9 but he surely scored some big goals in life he was recently in kerala and he was working with al jazeera he saw the environment there between the brazil argentina game you must have seen whatsapp videos of 10000 fans watching together costu now delhi has a quiet winter no big screenings no such environment to even my surprise so tell me what are the reasons tell me you know about your experience in kerala and all of that i think the reason why kerala has this massive football culture is because it's had these foreign influences for since the very day india was discovered by foreign explorers so i think that's where i think 
the that's where i think football really came to india they are absolutely mad for these godlike former footballers such as diego maradona kaka and now of course we got messi ronaldo and neymar there i mean they absolutely worship those footballers and they've got massive cutouts there they generally support brazil and argentina but over time because of the star followings of say someone like harry kane or thomas muller in germany i think that that support has also grown you were there in the copa america win of argentina in 2021 in kerala as well tell me the environment describe the passion in the environment when I mean, there was a video which went viral at that time where it was almost as if kerala was argentina uh which i think always happens whenever there is a massive argentina result whenever there is a massive argentina win or anything like that i mean it happens every time if argentina win the world cup this time around it's going to be the scenes are going to be absolutely crazy so coming down to the world cup the next world cup in usa mexico and canada the 26 you know world cup is said to have 48 teams so that's 16 teams more so do you think that india of a blue tigers have a chance to be there i think there is a small possibility because i think i mean even though 48 teams are will play in the world cup yeah. i think there's a lot of teams at this point who are actually better than india a lot of foundational changes that have to be made in indian football structures so i think once they are made i think indian football will have a very solid foundation to play the world cup be it in next time around or 2030 or 2034 so there's still hope and lastly they you know you're working on the world cup you're watching the world cup but as a fan my friend tell me who are you rooting for in the world cup um uh, i generally support italy these days they didn't make it to the world cup but um i think brazil are one of the favorites i mean i'm fancying a brazil france final with i mean anyone out, out of the two winning because those both both the teams are fantastic thank you so much for your time gostu no goals on field no problem goals on paper lovely artwork no problem 3:30 match 6:30 match 8:30 match 12:30 match next day school next day game no problem teachers young fans alumni you can clearly see apj school pitampura eats breathes and even sleeps football and this is it for our three episode fifa world cup series i hope you like it let us know in your comments how you found this video This is Arijit Roy your football host from APJ Newsroom signing off with concept head Shalini Saxena and cameraman and videographer Mr Nitin Yadav Let's see who wins the cup on the 18th this weekend See you around <laughs>